Tonight at 6 o'clock, two women said that they were fired from Lululemon and Peachtree Corners for calling the police to report a robbery. 11 Alive's Teresa Bowles spent the day looking into what happened here. She spoke with both the women and Gwinnett County Police about what took place. No, no. Seriously, get out. You're looking at the scary moments during a robbery in progress. They swiped until they couldn't hold any more product and ran out the door. And Rachel Rogers caught it all on camera at the Lululemon in Peachtree Corners. We didn't really feel very protected or like know what else to do. Rogers says it had been happening for months. I was not working and someone like sent me a picture of the front entrance table and I was like, oh my gosh, like we just sold all the product. Like, Good job. And they were like, no, like someone just came in and stole everything. So she and a coworker called the police, but Jennifer Ferguson says the employee handbook and regional management told them they weren't supposed to do that. You kind of clear a path for whatever they're going to do. And then after it's over, you scan a QR code. Gwinnett police say there have been a few robberies in the area. According to the police report, the three men you see in the ski masks are now facing felony robbery charges, but the two workers say they were fired for calling the police. They have a no tolerance policy. They said because um, they have a zero tolerance policy. I reached out to Lululemon corporate. No one got back to me. Rogers says she had been with the company for five years and was a key leader at the time. Ferguson says she was an assistant manager for two. That was my sole income. So I did have to like file for unemployment and use all of my savings to pay for like my car payment. It put us in a bit of a bind. My husband is self-employed, so we're trying to figure out insurance. There is no severance. As for now, Roger said she had a job interview lined up after our interview, and Ferguson says she's still in between jobs and is in the process of sprucing up her resume. In Peachtree Corners, Teresa Bowles, 11 Alive News.